The chances of avoiding a huge defeat in the midterm election is getting slimmer and slimmer for Florida Democrats. The numbers keep running in the direction of Republicans as members of that party are voting early and in large numbers. Cap Capitol reporter Forrest Saunders takes a look. While nonpartisan, Democrats often benefit from souls to the polls events as more minorities get tapped to cast ballots. The stakes are high, so it's imperative that we get to the polls and we cast our vote. Your vote, your voice. Organizers say this weekend will be their biggest effort of the cycle. More than 800 houses of worship are engaged and a dozen events on the calendar. They're in Florida's big cities and rural counties. We're mobilizing canvassers, we're mobilizing uh, I mean, phone bankers, and we're getting them out there as well as offering rides to people that need a ride to the precinct to vote because their vote does matter and it does count. In 2018, souls to the polls likely helped tighten races statewide, including for governor. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. While Republican Ron DeSantis ultimately won, it was narrow, a margin of about 32,000 votes. That's despite a GOP lead of about 59,000 early ballots the weekend before the election. I think uh, Florida's proving to be a red state. But as Republicans will tell you, the metrics are much different this year. The party making inroads with Hispanics and exceeding Democrats in voter registration. Numbers from Thursday afternoon show the GOP with more than four times the ballot lead it had in 2018. This is a rejection of the Biden administration policies, and it is a strong support for the conservative values. Even with souls to the polls, it'll be incredibly difficult for Democrats to overcome their deficit, though they are holding out hope. <laughs> state Senator Jason Pizzo noting online more than 930,000 Democrats in the state have yet to return their mail-in ballots. That's more than the population of at least five states. He says, quote, take your ballot to a drop box at an early voting location ASAP at the Capitol for Saunders WPTV News Channel 5. And we hope you join us as the polls.